Uh, I'm the faculty director of the Center for Social Innovation at the Stanford Graduate School of Business. We see a social innovation as any novel or creative solution to an important social need or problem. One of the things that's distinctive about the idea of social innovation, they often emerge as the result of collaborations and the exchange of ideas and values between the nonprofit sector and the corporate sector. It's actually a very exciting environment for them, partly because of the caliber of their peers. They're in a room with other very senior uh, leaders, very experienced individuals doing important work. Uh, and they're uh, exposed to a top-notch faculty group. So the faculty that teach in our programs are world-renowned experts in their fields. As a result, the participants find it very engaging to be able to get cutting edge and innovative ideas directly from the source. Another important aspect of the learning environment is the small, uh, relatively intimate size of the programs. I had gone from a smaller organization personally to an organization that was four times the size. I needed some help. What worked most for me in the last year since I've been here uh, is one particular um, issue and that was visioning. Coming here, I needed to step away and truly gain a vision of our future. And it was this place that allowed me to get a sense of the need for that vision and to put together the beginnings of the foundation for the process to put that together. And so our board and our staff has put together a five-point powerful 10-year vision to get us to our 100th year anniversary. You know, there was part of me that just wanted a checklist. There was part of me that just wanted to just tell me what I need to do. And, and interesting enough, in the program, one of the things that really hit home with me was when Bill said, if you just came here looking for a checklist, you're in the wrong place. We brought you here, you're the leaders, you're the thought leaders, we brought you through this program to help you think. So as I was looking at what was available, it was really limited to conferences, and I didn't just want to sit in a conference and listen to someone speak. I really was looking for a program that was interactive. We felt that it was important to bring NGOs who are working in this space to have a better understanding of how businesses are also facing these issues and come to some middle ground in understanding how some of those objectives can be merged and how there can be solution path forward that really bring into account both sides of the equation. It helps me to get out of my, my own paradigm and there's times where it's really great to be able to call one of my classmates that has a different way of thinking and say, hey, what do you think about this? And it'll help me frame up something that I might have been thinking one way and realizing that's not really the best way to approach it. And it was really important to identify a program like the Stanford Executive Education Program that offers an opportunity to both build skills and new networks. The learnings they took away, both from a strategic standpoint, from a theoretical standpoint, were quite interesting, but more importantly, from an interpersonal interaction with business leaders, with the level of faculty that were engaged in this, and were really prompting some good, hard discussion amongst the group. I knew coming here that I was going to be in the presence of people in terms of the faculty who were these very whole people and who had experiences that they would bring to the table, not just business and not just as incredible teachers, which is such a priority here, um, not just someone that has the depth and the research, but people that are incredible teachers and also people that have this life experience that they're willing to kind of put on the table and also share. And I, I really can't imagine having gone through the last two years without those relationships and without even still today having those people as resources in my life. The faculty here at Stanford, especially for this program, which is all I, I experienced, um, are, they're just so passionate about what they do and they're, they're passionate and experienced about applying the deep research that they have done into every individual question and how it applies to the reality of the nonprofit world. I sat down with the foundation that helped pay for me to come here and sat down with their board and said we have got to send more leaders in Colorado to this program. We have to. And that's not just because they'll have an, an amazing uh, experience as individuals. It just helps us go to a place that isn't quite possible sometimes when we're just in our own backyard environment. When you bring the world to the same classroom together and we're trying to figure it out together and we bond together, so many things can change.